pray upon the body. Baby, 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 Lord Jesus. Wow. Jesus, those hey, couples, man, for the he's like, he's like, you better not cry. cry. You better not pout. No, better you know, you better, better not pout. You better not cry. Jesus you better is coming, coming to town. Like, it was see, so funny. Like, you're sleeping. <laughs> yeah, like, for the whole thing. Yo, like, when, he, when I first heard the tone of the song, I'm like, oh my God, I bet she's going to say Jesus. And then he started, Claus, he started he doing a little, a little, a little dance. Yeah, like a little dance, like a little dance. Like yeah. a tap, like them, them girls that kick up their legs. <laughs> it was oh my so, God, Cripple's a crack lately. <laughs> yo, he went, he went into, he was like, he just, he just goes on rants, like lately. But I love it though. Okay. He killed me when we were singing Don't You Wish Your Girlfriend <laughs> the other week. <laughs> oh man, it's so All funny. right. Okay, so let, let's go. Alright. Pray, but somebody pray. Alright. Oh, Bible study? Yeah. Ooh, Bible Temple Land. Yay! <laughs> Who prayed? Father, I just want to thank you so much. I pray, as I seldom pray. Alright. I just want to thank you for bringing all five of us here together. I'm very thankful because it's actually the first time all five of us have been together. I've got Meshach. Shadrach, the bad Negro, <laughs> Vietnina, and I'm not Margo. saying that in the name of Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and right and now. I am really glad that we're all here to fellowship take that back. together. I reject it. Right I now. reject that. We reject that. That is Meshach and that Shadrach. And no, Jesus. in the name of Jesus Christ, thank you for bringing us together. <laughs> let the Holy Spirit and spiritual knowledge be upon us and let us change our lives in a positive way with our spiritual growth and love. In the name of Jesus, Amen. 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 Mm. I should have prayed. You, you, you I tried to pray. You cut me off. How dare you? Revelation seven. Because you're giving us fake names in a prayer. Seven. Yo, okay. listen to some it Revelation says... seven, y'all. That's some good stuff. Okay. It says. Y'all say fake names. <coughs> wait a minute. We got two different versions. Yo, let me see what Bible no, you got. I got the New Living Translation. It's like more I got for the kids. New international kind of version. Uh, huh? You got the what? New international version. Yeah, but you know what? At least, well, my Bible is, is a little more uh, translated, so it's yeah. more simple. It's the is same it? word. It's the same it's word. Same words, but it's, it's, not, it's gonna sound a little different. It's oh, say. it's okay. Somebody read. One person read. You read. You read chapter here. seventeen. If you don't understand, then you can read chapter seven. How about we go verse by verse? Okay, verse by verse. Okay, right. I'll go to Revelation. Carl, leave that alone. You have a computer at home. You can do that I'll try at home. to do this at home so I like go to bed when I get home. I know we're not having a Bible study and you are on Facebook. I'm <laughs> <laughs> off <laughs> right now. <laughs> Unless you're watching Highway Praise, you're not allowed to be on Facebook. Yes, come I on. Mean, even, I mean, I'm not even on Facebook. I will, have, I have, but I will I'm, participate. I'm not kidding. <laughs> I do not have a phone. This is my only means of communication. You got an iPod with free texting. That's good enough. I can't use the iPod right now because it doesn't work. Well, too bad. Well, well, shut the computer off because we're about to go in. We're about to go in on the Word of God. We need the spiritual food. And you're, about, and you're sitting there and you feeding really yourself with spiritual garbage. <laughs> my Facebook. Drinking spiritual Coke right now. All right. Right. We're going to go verse oh. by verse. Excuse me. Right. That Coke. Verse by verse. All right. Read the whole thing. And your spirit might be interesting. We're going to switch back and forth. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, go, go, go. After I saw four angels standing at the door, at the four corners of the earth, holding back the four winds of the earth to prevent any wind from blowing on the land or on the sea or on any tree. Mm. And I saw another angel coming from the east, carrying the seal of the living God. And he shouted out to those four angels who had been given power to endure land and sea. Do not harm the land or the sea or the trees until God. Until, wait a minute, God, that's it, right? Or until, or until we put a seal on the foreheads of the servants of our God. Oh, I'm sorry. And I heard how many were marked with the seal of God. There were 144,000 who were sealed from all the tribes of Israel. From they were each well 12,000 each, which was of course Judea, Reuben, Gad, Asher, Naphtali, Manasseh, what? Manasseh, Simon, Le uh, Levi, Asher, Asher, Zebulun, Joseph, and Benjamin. After this, I looked, and there before there before me was a great multitude that no one could count from every nation, tribe, people, and language standing before the throne and in front of the Lamb. They were wearing 
white robes and were holding palm branches in their hands. And they were shouting with a mighty shout. Salvation comes from the Lord on the throne and from the Lamb. <laughs> all the angels were standing around the, around the throne and all and around the elders and the floor and the four living creatures. They fell down on their faces before the throne and worshipped God, saying, "They said, Amen. Blessing and glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and power and strength belong to our God forever and ever. Amen." Then one of the elders asked me. These in white robes, who are they? Where did they come from? And I said to him, Sir, you, you are know. the one who knows. You know, homeboy, what you talking about? <laughs> and he said, These are th these are they who have come out of the great tribulation. They have washed their robes and they have made them white in the blood of the Lamb. Therefore, they have therefore they are before the throne of God and serve him day and night in his temple. And he who sits on the throne will spread his tent over them. They will never again be hungry or thirsty, and they will be fully protected from the scorching noontime heat. For the lamb who stands in front of the throne will be their shepherd. He will lead them to the springs of life given water, and God will wipe away all their tears. Right, here's what I got from that. Everything, people, people want to get restoration. You know, lame, you know, lame and the lame and the disabled become able, and then everything gets wild up. I got it. I like that. Um, what stuck what stuck out to me in this chapter was something that I had read previously in the past, um, where on verse. Oh my God, it's a long verse. Um, part of verse 14, with the part where it says, These are the, they washed their robes in the blood of the Lamb and made them white. Because when it talks about, and I think in the book of Jeremiah, one of the books in the Old Testament, it talks about how the Lord, how when He forgives you for your sins, He'll make you as clean as snow. So that's what it kind of. <laughs> what? You know? I see this is this bishop that's mad funny. That says he's like, And the Lord was it, was it, took my red, my, my black God. car and dip it. And watch me wow the snow. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> he go oh, in. Oh, yeah. You That's know what I got out of that? Wait, what you get out of that? You said you might of Jeremiah. I think in Jeremiah or one of the other ancient prophets, probably like Isaiah or Jeremiah or one of the ancient prophets that like that when the Lord forgives you for your sins at back in those in that time, it talks about how he wipes your sins away and he cleanses you and you become as white as snow. Okay. Like the spirit is it like white, it's kind of like, it's a purifying color, so. Right. So as you, it's, as he cleanses you, and you become white as snow, your spirit is, is, is cleansed, it's purified. Uh -huh. And all your sins are, are, are free, so that's what. Word. So I'm getting an idea about this. About my audio Bible, like, you know, I could use this and put it on YouTube. Since, like, you know, the pastor said we were, we were responsible for the distribution of God's word. Mm -hmm. We're we responsible make, like, for what? For distribution, God's distribution oh, right. God's word. But we are the spokesmen. I know. But we are the spoke. But we are God's spokesmen. It, That's it, what I'm saying. Like you know, it's like the easiest way to get things out, to get it out. Like you know. Yeah. I thought but about making way. pamphlets or something like more simplified. Version. But you gotta understand something. A lot of people throw away pamphlets, videos. Once it's there, it's there. Yeah. <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? No it's just running, like the Bible. No hiding. <laughs> you know, it's like way it's, to do it. YouTube bank. Yeah. You know what I wanted. I wanted to, when I get money, you know, now, I wanted to get like MP3 players, buy a bunch of them, put Christian songs on them, and buy a lot of Bibles and just give it to homeless people. An MP3 and a Bible set. Okay, Bible is good. How is the homeless person supposed to charge the Bible? They got mad charges. They can go anywhere over here. I can. Um, there, there's a lot. I have, I have one of them. I have an MP3 player at home that works. They can go to the library. They can go or maybe to something battery charged, give yeah. them something rechargeable battery. I don't know. They could go somewhere. That's what I'm saying. If you upload it onto a website like YouTube, everybody goes there. That's true. But yeah, homeless like YouTube. people don't. <laughs> homeless people can walk into the library. Do, 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 do. Yep. <laughs> I mean, like you know, you there's, there's no, there's no way you cannot access the internet. Everybody has access to the internet, and if they, 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 they can't, they know somebody that can. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? That's true. It makes sense. Wait, what'd you say you got out of the scripture again? Oh, I said what I got out of the scripture 
the blind, the lame gets healed, this disabled becomes able, and all the problems are swallowed up by God. You like straight up, give me that. Oh, that's that. Oh, that's that problem. That, give me that. Thank you. So that, like you know, it, it, it's like saying Jesus is diesel. Okay. I run this. <laughs> Give me that. So, oh, you, oh, you got that? Oh, you see that problem over there? Snatch that up. Thank you. Okay. Because the thing is, like, he, he serves us and we serve him. It's got to be a two way relationship. God don't want you going through problems. He's like, look, son, I, what you see as a problem, I eat for dinner. That's true. Thank and you, you sir? Did he just say Jesus is diesel? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus is diesel. What's wrong with that? <coughs> I'm not disagreeing. Did you? I didn't say Jesus is How diesel. How did you say this? No, I said Jesus is diesel. He's diesel. Diesel, brother, strong. Yeah. What was it? Yo, That's clutch. I was reading the, the, about the book about the little boy that went to heaven. He described Jesus as strong. Thank diesel. Thank as, you. As like strong and like. Um, with shorter hair and I don't know. Now, like, I, I agree. I agree with the strength, but I'm not. I, everything else is kind of debatable about looks. Yeah, that's true. But I don't know. I hate that. But he said he said that like you can't like his father was saying you can't exactly describe like Jesus because it's something you have to encounter, but. The little boy saw a painting, like one painting he saw, and he was like, yeah, that's what I saw. Like, it was like, you know that child prodigy, the painter, her name yeah. is Akian or whatever? She got a painting called The Prince of Peace. Okay. And it's like, the little boy saw that painting, he's like, yeah, that's it. It portrayed you, like, shorter hair, like, I don't know, I don't want to say it was that, but it looks like the other Jesus pictures, but with shorter hair, kind of. Okay. But that struck the little boy because he said that's what he saw. But it wasn't like the father said he was going to say that it's that's what it is because you have to encounter Jesus. But the little boy that really struck him that that's the one painting that looks the most um, of like what he Jesus. saw, like Jesus, like what he saw. Okay. The other ones don't. He said. So I don't know. So go ahead. You want to go? What? I'm boogery. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry. I got, I got tissue. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I love you. Do you want to go ahead? Hmm? Cracker? I'm kidding. Sorry, cracker, I, cracker. I say a lot of racial slurs. I'm sorry. Yeah. I don't mean to. Though. It's alright. Oh. Is this part of my upbringing? Uh, no. <clears throat> Which I'm, I'm, I'm slowly Get getting rid of. I call him Wonder Bread. I call him all kinds 